Hey guys, welcome back to O2 and Shan GVG, Guy vs. Gal. Without Shan, we have... Michaela. So we have me and Michaela here, and we go on, we're going to play a game. We haven't played a game in a while, um, and this game is called what, Michaela? Would You Rather. Would You Rather. We have, I think, played this game before, um, so you can check us out in some of our very, very early episodes. If not, this will be a first time. I can't remember. But we're gonna have some fun. We wanna show you Yoshi too, he got his hair cut. So you can see he used to be fluffy and now he looks like this. Yoshi. He looks like this thing. Aww. Yes, he got his hair cut. It's kinda like a bear, but kinda like a lamb. <laughs> I thought it was like Something a Something like that. A deer, a lamb deer, bear. So he's a, a bearty lamb. His new name is a Bearty Lamb. I know his buns are probably in the camera, so let's get him down. Say bye, Yoshi. <laughs> He's kind of waving. All right, let's get to this game. Are you ready? Are you excited? Yes. All right, so of course, the whole intent of the game is to talk about something that you would rather do. You're going to get two options, and uh, it's also going to give you the percentage of the amount of people who picked one category over another. We'll add a little twist to this one. The person that is in the lesser percent category, or who gets it wrong, if you want to say that, will uh, have the other person draw on them. So they can draw something on their arm, their face, or whatever. <coughs> you ready? Yes. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, first question. Would you rather have unlimited data on your phone or have unlimited battery on your phone. <laughs> Ooh, tricky one. I know. I'll let you go first. It's unlimited da data because if you, because you can just charge it, but when you run out of data, then you have to delete a bunch of stuff. That's kind of annoying. I hate to say this, but I'm gonna agree with you because I we stream a lot of movies and videos, so I would rather have a no nonsense plan where I'm not worrying about my data. I can charge my phone at night, even though I always forget. It's less of a hassle. <laughs> Let's see. So as you can see, that was wrong. So 37% of people want to have unlimited data while 63% want to have unlimited battery on your phone. You're wrong and that's weird uh, because if your battery's fully charged but you can't use the data, what good is it? True. I guess you can still talk in text. Well, then what about the Google phone? You know how they put out this unlimited data thing? Yeah. They should have done the would you rather. Maybe. <laughs> All right, next one, you ready? Mm-hmm. You both got it wrong. Oh. oh. Oh yeah, I forgot. Thanks, R. We gotta draw on each other. We both got it wrong. Alright, you can draw first. Where are you drawing? What are you drawing? Where and what? I'm gonna draw on your arm. My arm. Okay. okay. I'm gonna draw a sad face because you got it wrong. A sad face. <laughs> you bigger. Oh, there we go. So I got a sad face on my arm. You can kind of see that it's very small. Mm -hmm. Alright. We're gonna draw on Kayla's arm now. She gets a... A sad lollipop. What? With hair. <laughs> so she gets a sad lollipop with hair. All right, next question. 
Would you rather change into someone else or stay yourself? I know what. <laughs> this time. Uh, I'll just go with my first reaction. My first reaction was to stay myself, not to be somebody else. So I'm just going to stick with that one. I want to stay myself. I would say stay myself just because I know what I like and all of that. And you'd have to learn that all. Like, if I liked steak and then I went to go eat a steak as another person, what happens if I didn't like it anymore? <laughs> My thoughts did not go that deep. But <laughs> that is a good reason. Let's see what the answer is. <coughs> yes, 66% say they want to stay themselves. 34% say change it to someone else. Dead on. All right, ready? Here we go. Would you rather have free McDonald's for life or have free vegetables for life? <laughs> free McDonald's. Come on. So I want to say the average person would think about this. She says free McDonald's. Well, but McDonald's the average person. Says apples. <laughs> the average person is thinking hamburgers and they're like, man, it sounds good, but then I'll eat too much and get sick. So I'm gonna go with free vegetables. You sticking with it? Yeah. Here we go. I told you. <laughs> That's just disgusting. So 63% say they would rather have free McDonald's. 37% say free vegetables for life. I remember there's a movie out called, uh, uh, I don't remember. Something about the guy that ate McDonald's for like a whole year. I think he just, he got sick or something. It was. It's weird. That, why? Like, it's, you it's, just, no. You just said it's, you would want well, Freeman Downs for duh, life. when you say it, but then when you actually do it. All right, your turn <laughs> to draw. What would you like to draw? You're gonna draw on the arm again, okay? What are you drawing? I know. Yo, she's peace. grattling. <laughs> okay, I have a peace sign now. I have a peace sign and an unhappy face. You probably can't see that, but it's there. All right, here we go. Next up. Would you rather? <laughs> Do you want me to say it? You want to read it? No. <laughs> Would you rather have diarrhea every day for three months or have a mosquito next to your ear while you sleep for three months? I know. Yoshi doesn't like that one. All right, you go first. Mosquito, because can't you just kill it? Well, this says it's going to be next to your ear for three months. Well, I, I, it can't you die. You lack sleep. This is a but, vampire mosquito. Uh, well, but diarrhea hits. It, and, you'll, and you'll be running back to the bathroom continuously. I'm with you. I think I would rather have a mosquito next to my ear than diarrhea. And wouldn't you get months. used to it after three months? I don't think I could get used to diarrhea. Yeah, it's kind of like white noise. So kind of something playing in the background. <coughs> it's like the Amazon. I'm with you. So we're going with the same one? Yeah. <laughs> so, Sixty percent of people want to have diarrhea for three months, while only forty percent want a mosquito next to their ears for three months. That's just that's horrible. All right, so my turn to draw, and yeah. then you get to draw. All right, you're gonna get SpongeBob SquarePants on you. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> yeah, everybody loves SpongeBob. And here he is. <laughs> All right. Kayla has SpongeBob on her. Of course, Sponge has little holes. Oh. <laughs> There's little SpongeBob SquarePants for you. Everybody loves Spongy, right? All right, what you got? What are you drawing? What are you drawing and what are you drawing? Gary. Gary, okay, ah! here's a Gary. Yoshi, you gotta be happy. Does Gary make any noises? It goes meow. How does Gary know what a cat sounds like? Oh, it's kind of upside down. <laughs> There's Gary. <laughs> All right, I got a Gary, a peace sign, and an unhappy face. You have a hairy lollipop and SpongeBob. All right, <coughs> next up. You ready? 
commercial. <laughs> Next up is a commercial. We have to watch 15 seconds of a commercial. I should run my own commercial. What would you call it? I will call it, oh, press the X. Never mind, we don't have a commercial. <laughs> All right, would you rather have a missing finger or have a missing toe? This is a hard one. I know. You wanna go first or want me to go first? I'll go first. Okay. okay, a missing toe because if you think about it, you use your fingers on a daily basis. All right, so I'm gonna say a missing finger because if you don't have a toe, it throws your balance off and it's hard to walk. Missing a finger, I guess it depends. Well, some people say a thumb's not really a finger, so hopefully if you miss your thumb, that's pretty that's hard. But if you're missing a games. finger, yeah, so you, mostly your thumb. So hopefully they're not talking about a thumb on here. I'm gonna go with toe. You're going with finger? Mm -hmm. Wait, no, you're going with finger. I'm going with toe. Yes, I wanna miss a finger. You wanna <laughs> miss a toe. Let's see. <laughs> so 19% of people would rather have a missing finger while 81% would rather miss a toe. Nah. All right, well you get to draw something. I'm gonna draw a person with a missing finger. Okay, One, so Caleb's gonna two, draw a missing three, finger person. Four. And, it's, and the fingers are all gonna be sad because they're missing the best friend. Finger number five. So I have sad <laughs> four fingers here. It's very sad. I'm sad that I have a four finger tattoo on me now. All right, so let's say two more. I'm gonna do two more? Yeah. All right, here we go. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Are you ready, Ari? Mm -hmm. We're all ready. Okay, interesting. Would you rather work for Google or work for Apple? Apple. Just cause? Just cause. Okay. Um, so hard when <laughs> Google's more of a software design company, kinda. I mean, they have their Android devices, so they do get into the hardware scope now. And they have uh, different why. VR devices. They, so you know what, their hardware and software, Apple is more of your upper tier hardware. Wait and software, iOS. You get discounts on all the phones you buy. You could, but Google owns Android, so you could get discounts there too. But it's not Apple. You don't get like the Apple store. All right, so you're going to Apple. I will go Google because they're newer, and I feel like they stretch across a larger technological field than Apple. Even though I don't disrespect Apple, they are the best of the best at what they do, but I'm going Google. You're going to Apple? Mm -hmm. And I guarantee people are going to say Google because they're newer. That's how younger wait, people wait, have grown up wait. nowadays. Nope, nope, you said Apple. No, hang on. But when when was the app made? Because Google still could be like... Oh, my. Oh. <laughs> I don't <want> to... <laughs> So 33% of people say they would work for Google. 67% say work for Apple. Mm -hmm. Okay. All righty. What you, what you doing? I'm going to draw... An apple. Okay. Right here. So you remember, whack for Apple. Now I'm a walking advertisement for Apple. So I got my <laughs> Apple on. All right. Last one. Would you rather be the best supervillain or a mediocre superhero? You first and me first. I know what I want to be. Medi mediocre superhero. Yeah. That's what you're saying? Yeah. I want to say a mediocre superhero also because of two things. Of course, you always want to be on the good side. The second, if you watch Teen Titans, Robin is the best and he's mediocre, but he's funny and he's great. So why would but you not also, want to be Robin? Also, if you're the best supervillain, that doesn't mean you're going to be taken down by the mediocre superhero. Uh, True. The best superhero could come and take you down. That's a good point. Yeah, I didn't think it, didn't, it didn't say that the mediocre superhero would come and try and beat you. That's true. Still got Superman somewhere out there. Or Captain America, because it's 4th of July. You true. Worst oh, I like Spider-Man. Oh, <laughs> whatever. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, this was a close one. 
51% want to be the best supervillain. 49% say a mediocre superhero. All right, so my last drawing, Kayla is going to have a banana on her. Oh, I see. It's like the people. And he is sticking his tongue out. <laughs> a nose. That's a banana. No, that looks like a nose. <laughs> there you go. What you got here? Last You're one. I have a monkey. A monkey. You can do it here so everybody can see it. Sure. Oh. <laughs> we got a monkey going on here. It's not happy because. All of my it. tattoos are not happy, according <laughs> to you. It's wearing the cape, too. Is this Curious George? No, he doesn't look like Curious no. George. <laughs> he can be mad, actually. He can be mad. Feet yeah, so I have a monkey with pointy feet. All right, well, there's another episode of O2 and Shan Would You Rather with Michaela. Yay! And she beat me. So I did lose that one. We'll play again. Uh, we will see you guys. Let us know if you play this game. It's always cool, it's free on the app. Uh, what are some of the funnier ones that you guys had to answer? And uh, let us know in the comments. Always feel free to subscribe to become a part of our family and click on that bell icon so you're notified when we put out new videos. Until next time, me and Michaela and everybody else will be chilling. Bye. Peace out. Sayonara.